Hello, everybody. Good evening to all of uh, our today's listeners and uh, Skyward Technology um, supporters. We have today quite many um, many participants I see here uh, online, and of course, many more uh, are watching us uh, through the YouTube channel, or maybe you will see this uh, uh, later. Uh, after the webinar already when it's uploaded in, in YouTube. So thank you again very much uh, a lot to our support as well, who is constantly here every time and recording this webinar and then posting it uh, to, to YouTube. But all right, let's see, we have uh, quite many good news to cover today. And of course, uh, as usual, we will uh, talk through the main presentation part, we will see the main aspects about the new revolutionary technology, what I'm here to present to you today. And then we'll see what, what comes out of this and what information we will uh, get, uh, get a chance to, to cover today. And if any question and, uh, questions arouse during the webinar, so feel free to ask them directly and I will answer them in the end or in the next webinar. But all right, a uh, little bit about myself. My name is Michael. I'm from Estonia and I have been Skyway investor and promoter for more than three years by now. And this has been a pleasure to work among such great uh, um, uh, partners who are constantly um, working toward uh, mutual goal to, to get this technology into the, well, physical world, so to say, to get the um, first commercial projects uh, running and then, of course, to get the first dividends um, to all of our investors. Because as we know, we have um, about one million investors uh, globally who are, who are all participating in this uh, system. And there are also many, many active investors. So uh, greetings to you all as well, because you are the power of a Skyward community and you make this uh, go to, to public much faster than it would with uh, with normal you know marketing and so on so thank you all a lot for for participating and and I wish us all a great success continuing success because we know this uh, project has been successful for, um, well for for all its um, time we can say because back in 2015 we we um, started with uh, in belarus with the first constructions so to say with the first uh, tracks that were constructed back then and uh, and since then it's uh, about uh, six years now and since then we have constantly achieved a lot of great uh, well uh, goals and then we have been very successful overall. But of course, we have to understand that this is a physical project and then the physical project, it takes time to materialize and it takes time to get to the market. And then we have to just be patient. And the only risk I see here today is the time timing risk because, well, we just don't know uh, how much exactly it takes to, to get to the um, uh, to get start uh, started with the first commercial projects but all right let's see as we know uh, I, well i i, I told, told you just recently just now that uh, we started from belarus about six years ago there is the first ever um, well build build uh, demonstration and certification center Many of models, many of our models are already certified as well. But the second, uh, well, this this what you can see on the picture on the slide right now. This is uh, a, a taken in Innovation Center, which is located in Sarcha in United Arab Emirates. It's about 50 kilometers from uh, uh, Dubai. Uh, me myself, I have been there uh, twice. First time there were only flags skyway skyway flags um, next to the main road where well the street the main street there of the highway and there were um, well the pedestrian road uh, on the uh, next to the pedestrian road there were these posts long post and uh, all of them were covered with skyway flags about two three kilometers um, long path was it 
it was truly amazing but then it was just an empty plot just a sand otherwise what you can see right now on the slide this is uh, this uh, came later uh, but uh, but the second time when i visited the innovation center in in dubai in Sa sorry in Saicha, then there was already the first uh, two um, supports were placed already um, on the ground and then well the, constru the construction has has had begun and also we got the chance to talk with Anatoly Unitsky. He did a tour there and an interview and gave, gave us interview and so on. So it was it was a great time. And of Expo 2020, which takes place this year in the autumn, in October, it starts. Then we have another chance to go there. Mm, of course, there are, this time there are some uh, special well, mm, uh, measurements or, or special uh, mm, things or steps we need to take uh, first before we can go there, before we can get the pass to go there as a group, because 500 people people are, mm, well, a Skyward community or organizes uh, uh, the visit to Innovation Center and to Expo for 500 people, but there are special rules to do to get this uh, chance i will tell this in the in the end but this what you can see on the slide right now this is uh see on the slide right now this is um, the first track this is 400 meter long and meant for tropical unicorn and of course there are um, well already we know that unicont was also tested there unicont is a special model for transporting uh, sea containers but the smaller ones on this track and the larger one the 40 foot long and and uh, tens of thousand kilogram weighing th that model will uh, will come uh, uh, will be placed on the second track but all right let's see mm. This one here is the Echo House. This is the only wooden house ever built in uh, in uh, United Arab Emirates, mm, which is also great and amazing is if you think about it. Then, uh, then this is the first and the only ever built, uh, well, at least officially built wooden house in uh, United Arab Emirates. So this shows how great relationships we have with uh, with the local government there. I have another picture from a different angle as well. Here you can see this is quite great. And the main idea or the goal of this house is to be fully um, sustainable in terms that it should produce its own electricity, its own water, hold its climate and so on. But how it will, well, how it turns out, we will see in, in, the, in the future. Ernesto. Mm. But all right, mm, this is the Unicar. Mm, this is the tropical Unicar, mm, which is, uh, mm, well, this is the first model there. It's four seated and, and the shapes, <laughs> the, the officials, they really love this, this model and they have already got the chance to try with it because the certification process is um, currently active with uh, people as well on board so so do you get the fully fully understand to fully understand wh how it works and then and because we need hundreds of thousands of kilometers on the test track before we can even take it on the well to say co co on the commercial roads uh, to, to implement it in in the in the public but this one here is the unicorn I was telling you before on the first track, the the smaller sea container one comes uh, comes. It, well, the, the second track actually should be ready. Um, sometimes when Expo starts in October November, and and uh, there then on that the second track they will demonstrate and start the certification process for uh, for the larger sea containers and there is a really great advantage as well if you compare this system with well we only have actually the ship shipments well the sea containers uh, that are taken from one place to another by ship and then the the other option is by a truck well the cars the truck truck cars 
and and uh, but the trucks and ships the, the average speed is about uh, 15 kilometers per hour mm, and if we well of course trains as well the, the normal trains sorry but if we well like, for example let's compare it with the train if if we have train and the railways then then the container or the mm, train can go only one side on on one pair of tra uh, rails so but with skyway i will show you the picture later as well there's an option because we have this red track here not this one but but the, the larger one the double rail then one c container can be beneath the track uh, driving here and the other one on the top of the track so this makes it uh, two times uh, more efficient already uh, because we have the chance to go two directions at the same time in parallel and also we have uh, well the speed is about 190 to 100 kilometers per hour and the loading or the talking time is uh, under one minute so it takes uh, things much faster on, from one point to another and we can even place the special plateaus on the mm, on the sea so up to five kilometers to the sea so we don't have to ruin the ruin the the with the coastline and we can take cargo from from the sea directly to the mainland where it's needed so this is awesome as well oh and here is uh, what else they will be testing on the second and third track in uh, sarcha is the well mm, the transportation models for people but more than 100 people at the same time so there, there will be also more heavier than, than the smaller one because as we know the possibility is basically starting from one person in the cabin this is called unipike and and right now it's up to 28 i believe or 40 48 people at the same time in one model but the, with the new solutions we will be testing more than 100 people uh, at the same time transportation system which is quite uh, quite great but all right let's see how much we cover i will try to take this briefly and quickly and walk you through the main presentation part and then uh, this uh, slide actually describes and reminds me uh, a lot of well this is from history it's about 100 years ago made uh, it's made yes about 100 years ago uh, by an artist who visioned uh, our future as you can see on this picture and what i would like to say uh, is that uh, if you think about the main biggest cities in the world let it be for example paris or or well you name it the bigger ones where they have uh, subway systems or the metro underneath the under the ground also they have all these um, trains trams um, buses uh, electrical vehicles so basically very well built first level infrastructure and the under still uh, occur and they even grow because the population grows the number of uh, vehicles in the in the traffic grows and then the more and more people come to live in the cities to work there and then and, to get educated and so on so therefore the problems uh, grow but the solutions well since we have no place to to build new roads anymore we have already covered the underground uh, subway systems on the first level we inside the cities we just cannot tear down the tear down the buildings and then build well we can but uh, it's very complicated and then uh, nobody is going to do that at least in the well developed countries you won't just take down big building to build a new roads but uh, therefore the only solution is to go um, to the second level and that's why i'm sincerely sure that the skyway is here to stay and it will be implemented all around the world as we know the global the, the global mission for for skyway and uh, dr anatolio niski is also to to um, construct uh, tens of thousands of kilometers around the world and then yes so this is very great goal but some technologies that already exist here the trains the monorails on the right side this is the monorail as well as you can see it's very large construction very massive and heavy and then not so great for the eye as well eyesight then in uh, in berlin in germany they use uh, in, let's see 
in China is uh, it's, it's like a tram, upside down tram. Biotechnology itself is a tram. And this is uh, on the right side. This is also very largely used nowadays, and mainly when when people ways then they, they think and talk about this solution on the right side but uh, there is uh, something important to notice or understand about it is that the wheel well the engine is uh, is in the beginning usually in the beginning of the track and it spins like you can see on the orange uh, wheel here on the right side it, it spins and takes the mm, cable uh, with it, so the cable moves, not the models themselves move, but the cable moves, and therefore the capsules or the models where people, where the people are inside, uh, that one uh, will stiffly holds to the cable and moves al along with the cable, not the itself. So that's that's important to notice or understand here, and of course, of course, metroways. So some some I just brought out some. Of course, we have the idea of hyperloop, thousand kilometers per hour, which is very expensive and quite dangerous to hold it in a vacuum all the time and so on. So of course, the flying drones uh, is on the table. But uh, when well, if you think are people ready to to fly on drones and how do you manage the traffic's there? Traffic there up in the air, it's it's quite difficult. But we have if we have a like on here on this on the picture with Skyway, we have a straight lines. We have a certain road to 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 build the stations. Also, then then it's much different. It's much uh, more understandable. But yes, welcome to the new age. Now let's see some main points why Skyway is here to stay and like I uh, always like to say, rock the world. First point is that Skyway is innovative, uh, as you might understand already by the, by the presentation that I have made so far for you. Then it, it is very innovative by the looks already and then by the design and uh, there are many more aspects uh, by which it's uh, innovative. Of course, the electricity part it uses on elect ele electricity, and the solar panels, the wind turbines. This technology has already exists, as we know, and they can also be implemented to the um, track um, uh, next to the supports, for example, or the wind turbines uh, directly to the models. So when they move, they make energy as well. So they have been thought about everything. And here you can see on this slide very well what I meant before with. Uh, C containers that we can try two sites at the same time. It's not only with C containers, of course. It's it's with uh, the normal commission, well, uh, models, unibikes, unibuses, or unicars, which take people from one point to another. Uh, it can also be implemented like this. So, one, uh, for example, unibus on the top and the unicar below the track. So two uh, times uh, two uh, parallel ways to go at the same time. Or, for example, the express line uh, atop, because we know that um, under construction is right now the um, the model which goes up to five to six hundred kilometers per hour. So that one can be on the top, and beneath it, it can be well. The, for example, the same model like you can see on this picture here, uh, which takes um, more stops. So not the express line, so to say. But by uh, the rate structure, it's also quite simple, actually. Mm, it's nothing new, uh, so to say, but uh, the, um, the combination of different technology, technological aspects aspects are uh, is never done before. So that's why Anatoly Niska has put together so many, um, well, for example, like the string rails here, which are pre-stressed string rails, which are then taken to the rail, uh, rail body and uh, filled with special filler and we can for example take uh, different kind of communication and the communication cables say internet for example or electricity through the track itself as well so just we need to implement some holes pipes um, here in the, in the filler so before filling it with a special filler we can also implement these um, tubes through which the communication cables can be then taken for example, in Africa, where many villages are without electricity, constant electricity, or, or the elect well, the mm, systems are are bad and uh, and don't work uh, well constantly. 
at the, at, the, at the same flow all the time, then it's very good to take uh, great electricity or, or internet there. Then um, let's see what else we have. Oh yes, the EcoFest 2000, just another glimpse. You can actually take a look at this video via YouTube if you put in my name, then, uh, then it uh, arises there. So you can see it uh, there. I, I, won't, I won't stop here uh, for longer, but it was a great day. So uh, yes, I have been both in uh, Eco Techno Park and, and in Sarsha as well. So I've seen it all. That's why I'm also very enthusiastic and uh, and then, uh, well, the ambitions are great. And I know that the ambitions of company and Anatoly Niski are great as well. And they're doing everything to, to get the, their idea into the world to manifest it here and then and, and as you can see this picture as well because there's more than a thousand words it's uh, it's very neat it's uh, sharp and it looks great in the nature as well it makes only up to 50 decibels uh, noise pollution so it's almost right now and again uh, the, the two side the monorail effect uh, to sim simultaneously um, same time, uh, driving is uh, perfectly pictured here on this slide. One above and the other, the other model uh, underneath it. All right. Of course, CO2 levels, as we know already, they have to be reduced and taken to minimum. And then uh, this uh, Skyway also benefits from, from this. And uh, the wind um, resistance is another aspect which makes it um, which makes it uh, um, very efficient for a skyway and takes down the energy costs um, because of the shape of the body, of course. And the another aspect is the screen effect, which does not occur with skyway. The screen effect is when basically a car is riding on asphalt and then the wind goes beneath the car and uh, and then the world goes goes against the asphalt or the road there and that causes wind resistance these two effects are taken to minimum with skyway because we are on the rails and the wind can go perfectly beneath the rail all right of course many many different problems on the first layer which which are not a problem with with skyway and then when constructing now the new roads for example railroads then we have to understand that we, we well to maintain its structure and to so so that the rails for example on the ground they can be uh, there for a long time they have to dig the construction company has to dig about seven meters below the ground to fill it with special fill fillers so the trail rail track, track uh, hold uh, can hold itself uh, at the same place and won't go anywhere off you know or wouldn't need replacement so often. That's why it's uh, it's also important. To notice that this takes a lot of uh, uh, enormous amount of energy and enormous amount of resources to to do that. But with Skyway, we can actually take it up to 100 meters above the ground. So basically, we can go over the forests or or over the mountains or and and so on. And we even well, yeah, basically, we don't have to. Uh, make explosions to to clear the path for for new railroads in the mountain mountain areas, but we can just uh, take it uh, well the other the other way around like here on this picture, find the new ways because we just need supports places to place supports and the supports can be of course on different uh, heights, um, depending on the necessity of of the surrounding. And uh, water is no problem. And this one I already covered as the, due to the amount of new cars and then well, almost every grown up person has its own car and it's quite affordable to, to get the car these days. Yes. And this is the, the, this, this slide just our eyes can rest rest for a while all right the third point is safety safety is covered as well uh, with many aspects um, first firstly the de derailment system which holds the models on the track they basically can uh, put it upside down and it still still uh, holds it uh, there it's like spider 
then the another aspect is the automated intelligence system basically every model has uh, 360 degrees uh, eyesight so if any obstacle comes in the way it immediately stops and tries to hold uh, all the way the accident whatever and inside uh, there is an eye also for interior so when we cross the border for example we can just show our, show our passports or qr codes or whatever uh, we need to show it just to get pass from one well for example from border so everything has been uh, uh, given thought about and if anything happens with one model then the other similar model they both have these elements in front and in the end so in the nose and in the tail and they connect with each other perfectly so the another model which works uh, it can either pull or or push it to do the station onto the maintenance and if that uh, the previous solution is not an option then we all we can put around our waist and then uh, lift us uh, lift us uh, down much more uh, comfortable <laughs> and then uh, much more sa safer than this way of uh, traveling what do you think <laughs> all right the fourth point is that we have real models and products we are just not um, well they are not just some pictures from the catalog and animations but we really have products we have many of them certified already by russian and belarus standards for example like the unibike uni unicar unibus and then many models are under certification by european uh, regulatory and and by by the and for, for tropical climates as well because in in sasha sasha is mainly the wind for, for example uh, vietnam and so on where most of the people actually live as well and where it's needed the most so that's why this uh, sasha innovation center is a very important uh, place for us and here is the unicont what you can see on the on the picture right now and with unicont this is great that it can be as i mentioned also twice already before it can be either above the track or beneath the track so some simultaneously two two ways we have uh, which we can take at the same time the fifth point is uh, mm, uh, what we are covering today is that the, the demand for skyways everywhere and uh, and it's growing due to the reasons I have mentioned during the presentation and I believe everybody understands it and stands that all right six point professional and uh, strong team of course that's what uh, what's needed and the UNISC has put together a very great team they have over 600 workers and you know, professionals on, on their field and they are constantly working toward this goal and seven point is that it is financially beneficial and here i can see two main uh, groups or two main uh, sides mm, first one is the customer who orders this technology to be placed let it be a private company or governments but if you compare skyway with different uh, another different uh, technologies i have showed you also uh, in the beginning of the this presentation then so that there there was monorail and the trains and trams and then basically the cost of skyway is similar to trams a tramway but it has much more benefits as we know a tram also rides about uh, 20 kilometers per hour or even less so skyway inside the city goes up to 150 kilometers per hour and then uh, between the cities it can go up to 600 kilometers per hour so this is an uh, enormous different difference all right and now the news we are in the end uh, section of the presentation in the final final section and then uh, of course uh, the first uh, news is about the uh, united arab emirates where they mm, announced a project address project which is about 100 kilometers long and should connect uh, sasha with a city called korfakan and is meant for uh, sea container transportation mainly then of course uh, also already mentioned is that we take part in expo dubai 
which will be a great uh, great event but i will talk a little bit more about this uh, later then we have uh, had many many uh, coverages uh, in various news channel around the world uh, mainly because when when they first started uh, the test with sea containers and with people on board uh, the tropical unicar in in uh, sarcha then of course many news channel wanted to cover this so now let's see some of those for example in united arab emirates most of the news channel covered this in french in india for example cnn covered us in uh, united uh, united states as well in Romania and also so this is uh, great for for the company as well then uh, out of future publication was made about the Skyway certification touch the projects again one news channel which has a lot of followers and then uh, that's it about that right now but uh, but we are in media almost uh, every month or every week somewhere in the world so we we have to be seen Mm, through, through that through these channels so a lot of people know about already but uh, many of many of them uh, still do not understand that we have a chance to take part of it by investing into the company and and receiving a valuable uh, technology uh, well the mother company shares which basically means that where, wherever in the world skyway is going to be built and it starts making uh, profits then it will be paid uh, to investors as well by dividends, 20% of, of the profits. And the, of course, when we, uh, sometime in the future, when we enter the public market uh, through IPO, then we can either sell or buy more shares. But this uh, opportunity to do that, that is right now presenting us to do invest and, and get the shares, it's it's an enormous discount for, for the price of the share. and will be also limited amount of shares both and in, in time as well so right now we have this chance but in the future sometimes it will end and then we can just uh, recognize it uh, the technology when it starts to be being implemented somewhere in the in the world and we will see it look look son or daughter or, or a friend the i have invested as well and every time when some person writes with it i will make a little bit and money from it as well so this is a great thing but the right about expo now more um, inside um, well uh, hall expo hall there will be a mock-up like you can see on this picture very great the design and all the people who are interested in this technology and to get more about uh, more information about it can go directly to the Sacha innovation center to look at uh, with their own eyes so i urge you as well if you're not uh, well getting the chance to go there with Skyward community mm, group then uh, go there by yourself and go take a look definitely many other great uh, solutions and techno technologies and then just go there and take a look and uh, and go visit the Sarge innovation center as well yes here is another another picture of this amazing brilliant all right, and now now the big Emirates tour and uh, and um, Sky World Community Marathon, and there are uh, different categories. There is bronze, silver, and gold. And the main idea is that we need to invest ourselves, and we need to invite at least uh, some persons to our first line. So directly, we need to invite them, uh, and and they have to make as well investments. And uh, the bigger the investments are, the bigger are uh, our well, the results, and we will receive either bronze, silver, or, or gold. And there are also uh, all kind of different promotions for us. For example, they with with gold status, we can um, receive 500 US dollars for our plane tickets, and we will get the three nights in in a great hotel there, as well as the uh, big Emirates tour. So we could go and see all different kind of um, well. Uh, touristic places um, and of course we will go to such innovation center and ticket for expo as well silver um, do not have this big emirates tour and, and uh, complement it's uh, plane tickets but otherwise uh, it's the same and bronze has only the opportunity to go to the expo uh, and to to the Sarcha innovation center but otherwise we have to pay our souls 
so and then the places are limited as i said there are 500 and then 114 uh, is the is the number of places left uh, by today's data so yeah amazing just uh, go to your back office and you can see all the terms and then uh, what you have to do and so on by yourselves and then just uh, hurry up because it it, uh, it goes on until this this month until uh, sorry until september so the 31st october is, is uh, august august is the last date but now i always like to finish my presentation with this slide where dalai lama gave his blessings to dr anthony nitski and to sky and he said his holy holiness said that uh, this project is uh, absolutely necessary around the world but uh, it won't be easy for you this path you have chosen but eventually you will uh, be successful so uh, great words and inspiration from the Dalai Lama as well but all right today we will finish our presentation thank you uh, thank uh, thank you all for coming and to see what uh, what has happened and then to get a glimpse about the technology just remember to take part of this um, Skyward community uh, marathon, marathon for for getting the chance to go to Innovation Center and to Expo as well. This will be a fantastic uh, opportunity for all of us. And next time we will meet uh, exactly in two weeks at the same time. Mm, so be there, invite more people, tell about uh, the technology to all of, all of your friends and and uh, relatives, so they could understand as well it and then maybe even invest it so to get the benefits uh, later when when everything has uh, well when we are going to to make our first implementations commercially but all right thank you again and then see you already in two weeks bye bye <laughs>